friends and welcome back to another Dream Island tour. Today we are going to be taking a look at the amazingly creative island of Gerudo made by the lovely Sophie. Uh, they go by Hyrule, B-O-T-W underscore A-C-N-H on Instagram and as I'm sure you can tell it is inspired by the Gerudo region in The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Um, let's have a little look at the map. Let's make sure it's on as well. So we have Sophie, who is our main island resident, and then Maple, Annabelle, Bangle, Wade, Chester, Clay, Maddie, Anka, and Coco. So many cuties. So I would usually be uh, doing this, uh, these sort of tours on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash Chloe Rosie. Let's get that promo in super quick and hop into the, uh, the tour. So we've been given a ladder and a vaulting pole, which I believe the creator said the vaulting pole is to help protect us against the enemies of the desert. So uh, yeah, we're all appropriately dressed and equipped. Let's wander out into Gerudo Town, which is already amazing, like, to me who loves this game so much, I, it's so instantly recognisable. It's actually my favourite area in the game, I think, because you have like, all these stalls, you can get well equipped for the journey ahead. I love desert regions in games because I'm from the rainy UK, so uh, <laughs> it's a nice change. And all the characters here are so likeable. And already, like, this town just feels so dense, but in a really good way. Just like it feels like in the town itself in the game. We have our little sand seals here, which are adorable. Um, they have all these codes up on their Instagram, which I definitely recommend you check out because, oh my goodness, they have, like, four Breath of the Wild islands. Oh my god, the jewelry shop. They have four Breath of the Wild Islands, I believe, and they're all so stinking creative. Like, oh, all these areas are just so recognisable. Like, you have the spa, the jewellery shop, you have the bar up here where you can sip on your noble pursuits as the, the day goes by. And then up here we have a very familiar face. Hello! It's Sophie and she says, Savota. Savota to you, my friend. Now I believe they, the creator said they had decorated the main room and the upstairs. Um, so let's take a little look. Oh, I love it. I love it already. We have like the Thunder Helm. This is Riju's throne. It's such an amazing uh, recreation of the, um, the palace, I suppose it is. This is so stinking cute. I love it. And then we have her bedroom, oh my god, with the little sand seal plushies. I love it in uh, Breath of the Wild when you come into like Riju's room at certain times of the day and she's just there like cuddling her little sand seal plushies, it's super cute. <laughs> oh this is so cool, I love how they've used the, uh, the wedding arches as well to make the bed. This is super cool. Oh, I love this area so much. And this island, this island is so creative. I just love coming to all these islands and them making me feel like I need to tear up my own. <laughs> okay, so I think we've had a good look at Gerudo Town, I believe. Yeah, we've had a good look. This is the cool training area, I love it. So we're pretty well equipped with our vaulting pole. Let's head out into, uh, into the desert. I believe if we... Uh, we come down here we'll see a nice little a nice little treat as well and this area oh, we better be careful we don't want to wake up the lizard though <laughs> like for for like a desert island i suppose they've decorated it so amazingly so that your your eyes are always finding something it's not just nothing <laughs> there's just not just a, a it is a wasteland but in a very interesting way yeah, we have the little shrine here. I think it's Dehoche, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> and then I think over here, yeah, we have the um, the sand seals and also the traveler who we um, 
essentially flirt with to get the sand and snow boots, which I love. That's one of my favorite side quests. Link does not care. He's like, can we go on a date? No. <laughs> okay, let's head out back into the desert. Let's come over here. Ooh, I recognize this. I recognize this straight away. It's a Kara Kara Bazaar, isn't it? I love this. I love the music as well. This is, this is cat jam worthy. <laughs> this is so nice. We have the campsite. And then we have, I guess this would be like the shop where you can uh, buy things. <laughs> I'm struggling. <laughs> Come down here and let's come through here first. Ooh, I know what this is. It's the seven heroines, right? The seven heroines, seven statuette things. And I do recognize this area from uh, from their Instagram because if we look up here, we can see the uh, Divine Bees Varnaboris up there. Like, how cool is this? This is just, oh, I love how people are using the the fossils in such a creative way like the map like oh, thank you. i can't remember what it's called but there's one that looks like a massive deer and they make it look like a like a guardian it's just or a guardian of the woods not a uh, <laughs> not a zelda guardian we don't talk about those <laughs> okay we've stocked up on our food let's head out and come up here this looks a little foreboding in the distance, but we'll, uh, we'll leave that for now. Let's come over here to ooh, there's another shrine up there. Maybe that's like the windstorm one. I can't remember. Ooh, and I do recognize this. This is the um, the northern ice house. I think it's called. We have to bring uh, the block of ice through through all these. Uh, place. <laughs> I can't think of the word. Where it's full of monsters. It was not fun, but we did it. Uh, I played Breath of the Wild on stream and it was so fun. We managed to 100% it for the first time ever and I am so hecking happy because <laughs> those Koroks, I struggle with those a lot. Okay, let's come down. Is it Carusa Valley? I don't know, but this is so cool. I guess we did need our vaulting pole to fight off the Yiga. Let's come up here. Oh, I love it. Oh, Anka, what are you doing down here in the Yiga clan hideout? Oh, this is so cool. Hold on. Let, let's try and talk to her. What is she doing? What is she doing? <laughs> Hello, my dear. It's a pleasure to meet you in such a dreamy place. I hope you make some wonderful memories while you're here. More importantly, I hope you're able to remember those memories when you wake up me meow <laughs> well i don't know are these gonna be good memories in the yiga clan fortress i don't know but i love it and this is i think this is um koga i really hope this is um suga from age of calamity because everybody loves him including me <laughs> oh this is so creative i love how they've used the festival items and like the zen items this is super cool. I love it. Okay, let's wander through the valley, collecting our hydro melons on the way. And let's look up here. Is, oh, the way they've built up all the canyon walls is so amazing. Oh, this is so cool. Ooh, what is, is this supposed to be the, um, ooh, what is this supposed to be? I love it. It looks like a, like, the Coblin hideout, or maybe it's the spot where you get the Great Fairy, maybe? Ooh, I like this little camp, that's super cute. Okay, let's wander through here. Oh no, this is the Great Fairy Fountain. Whoa, this is so cool. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> Here's the shrine over here, I think. I think I've remember something about this island but I can't quite I don't want to say it in case it's not <laughs> Ooh. oh this is so cool this is so pretty I love it <laughs> maybe hmm. oh 
I just realized the the um the stone uh hinges, they're supposed to be like the skeletons, aren't they? Oh that's super cool. I think I also missed. Let me come back over here. I'm trying to use their uh their little map as a reference. Let's see if we can see it from here. Can I see it from here? Hmm. Oh wait, maybe I need to climb since, you know, they did give us a ladder. <laughs> that would be helpful. Is it? Yes! Here's the, uh, the Gerudo Tower. That's so cool. That's super cool. Really creative as well. I love the, uh, the designs they've used. I think this is the one that overlooks, like, the pit. That is really freaking cool. I love that. <laughs> okay, let's slowly make our way back. I think we've had a look at everything that is to see. This is such a beautiful island. I just, I love it so much. It's so creative. They've made a desert island that's so interesting and there's always something for you to see and it's so full of references and honestly how they've made and replicated some of these places i have no idea but i love it okay let's wander back through to the uh the entrance this is such an amazing island i could just wander around here for hours <laughs> This is so cool. Okay, well I think that is everything we have come to see today. Um, this is an amazing island. I love it so stinking much. Um, so yeah, be sure to go check out Sophie on her socials. Um, the links are down in the description box. Um, and also uh, be sure to check out my Twitch channel where we'll uh, be doing more stuff like this on stream during the week. I normally stream on Wednesdays and Fridays, uh, but I am a full-time student, so we'll uh, we'll see how my schedule goes. <laughs> but uh, yeah, do give this video a like if you liked what you saw. Go check out the creator, I give them so much love and support, and uh, drop a comment below if you were uh, to tell me what uh, references you saw and if I missed anything. But uh, for now, I will leave that there. I hope you all have the most amazing day. I love you all so much. And I hope to see you very soon. Bye.